Learning Management System, or LMS. We've chosen Canvas as our LMS, and we want to tell you a little bit about why we chose this and what features it has to offer. We also want to show you around so you can see for yourself. A lot of LMS options that are out there that we've used and that we looked at are rather antiquated, even cumbersome and confusing to use, and they throw up roadblocks in the teaching and learning process. We wanted to choose an LMS that would serve our professors and students well by providing a good user interface and integrating easily with other web tools that would enhance our teaching and learning here at the seminary. So, see for yourself, see what you think. Uh, let me know if you'd like to know more or have any other questions. We hope you like what you see and are interested in distance learning here at Kelvin Seminary. Let's take a look. When you enter Canvas, this is what you'll see. Your main page is a stream of recent activity for all your courses. This includes recent discussion comments, assignment alerts, notifications, anything that's been happening recently. Along the right side is a to-do list and coming up list that helps you stay on track of your work. You can enter an individual course to see a stream of activity just from that course. One of the best ways to get an overview of a course in Canvas is modules. When you click on modules, you'll see these containers that contain all the items for a weekly lesson. This might include readings, might include content such as a video presentation, discussions, assignments, quizzes, and so forth. This also shows the sequence or outline of online lessons that we're trying to use here at Calvin Theological Seminary. Engage, explore, apply, review. Engage is the initial encounter with concepts or an author. Explore is a deeper exploration. Apply is a connection to a real life situation in ministry 